All right, y'all. So my freaking wig. Okay, I'm not. Um, what's it called? Doing the glue down method or whatever. The ball cap method. That's what it's called. So right here in the inside of my wig, it has like these straps or whatever. So I put it right here on the. You see how they have like different levels you can put it at different volumes or whatever so i ended up putting on the ones that's like all the way at the end so that way when i put it on my head my wig be like the it be stuck on it it's a little vibe so that's what we're going for <laughs> i don't know why i had to do all of that so that's what i did and yeah remind you i got this wig from amazon i also don't have that much lace in the inside no more because yeah, I was. I used this wig by like two times, but I'm a beginner in the wig, so I really don't know what I'm doing. I'm just trying, going with the flow of things, and I don't want to keep buying more wigs and then messing them up. So I'd rather just keep practicing on one until I master that, and then I go ahead and go to the next one. That's literally what I do. I use stuff until I can't use it no more, child. And I throw it away. <laughs> I don't know why I'm like that. I will show y'all the company that I got it for. Got it from from Amazon too. All that, all that stuff will be in a description below you already know so yeah okay so i didn't like glue the wig down i just applied it and started to sculpt my edges my edges out instead of like um i don't know when i was parting when it's come to parting your edges like in the front make sure you do like kind of like a c-section like a carving out section so it just won't be you know to make it look natural pretty much but yeah that's pretty much what i'm doing girl i'm just getting all my edges out the way so that way i did it this way so that way when i um glue my lace down i feel like i'll have a more visualization of where exactly my edges will look like and where they're gonna be at whatever usually i'll see people glue their wigs down first and then they do their edges after but it was vice versa for me so yeah I ended up taking these alcohol pads and making sure that area right there is like super squeaky clean because we don't have time to, what's it called, trap some dust or, you know, some dust underneath the lace, girl. We ain't got time for that. But right after I did this, I ended up slicking down my edges because I do not want my freaking glue get onto the edges and then i ain't got no more edges child so i ended up taking the edge booster gel because i didn't have no edge booster at the time and they got to be glue spray and i ended up putting on the front and i put like two sections i believe i went i did this twice and then um i went in with the blow dryer brush it back and tried to make it i pretty much blow dried it back if that makes sense but yeah Okay, y'all, I don't understand why I ended up pulling my cap so far to the front. I feel like I was trying to pull it all the way to the front to, to pull all my edges back in a sense. But when I did that, um, when I put my lace forward and stuff, you can see my, ca my, my case, <laughs> my cap in the back. So later on in the end of this video, I ended up pulling my cap further back so that way you won't see it on the lace in the front, if that makes sense. But yeah. Hey, 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 hey,
toe. Yeah. So to the head and float. Yeah. Already fed the pope. Yeah. Niggas too scared to go. Yeah. Okay, sis, do not get on me, but I had put a lot of glue. Like, seriously, I put a lot of glue. But as you can see, girl, it's nowhere near my edges because I was not playing that, sis. But, um, yes, um, I definitely put a lot of glue. And then the outer layer that's closer to my eyebrows, I ended up wiping, wiping away all of that extra stuff, girl. I didn't know it was that much extra and that much far off until I... To, and to see until i started to put the lace down and then, then that's when i realized damn like this is a lot of glue so i ended up um sticking it down slicking it down whatever putting my waist the waistband the wig band on there and then i got the alcohol again and ended up cleaning all that extra glue off girl it was just it was a lot it was very messy and then i ended up cleaning majority of it off and redoing some parts again because it was messed up but yeah so learn from my mistakes please don't use a lot of glue a little tab would really go a long way honestly but yeah comes to this part it can get very tedious because it will get to the point where you're not you're gluing the lace on there but the hair on the lace will actually try to stick on there so i try to like glue the lace down while brushing the hair back so that way the hair won't be stuck in the glue if that makes sense and it's kind of actually harder on the side tabs too as well because it's just i don't know for me it is at least but um i ended up putting the got to glue got to be glue sprayed on there be child and don't do that because it's gonna make your edges hard but at the end i ended up coming it out anyway so yeah <laughs>
Nobody do that dance, you're nasty up, and them nasty up. Fix things, fix things. I would like to get to know if you could be the kind of girl that you can. Thank you guys for taking your time off for watching this video. I really hope that you guys enjoyed this tutorial with me. Don't forget to hit that like button if you like this video. Drop a comment below if tell me how I did it in this video, sis, or any more tips and tricks that you would like, you know, to add to the, you know, whatever. Because I really just don't know. I be looking at other people's videos and stuff like that. But nothing more, nothing less, y'all. Stay blessed. And until next time, peace.